I'm Nina McVeigh. And I'm Susan Beck. Susan, I've brought a lot of different pieces of applique with me today. Gorgeous. Thank you. They represent a variety of applique techniques. Some I've done with the blanket stitch, some with decorative stitching, even straight stitching. But the one thing that they all have in common as applique pieces is that at some point you have to stop and pivot your fabric. As you're going around the shapes. Correct. So I really want to show off our Bernina 8 series machines. I want to show you applique on the Bernina 830 today specifically because of the hover mode and the dual feed. First I'm going to engage the dual feed. That's going to help me move everything smoothly through the machine. And which presser foot are you using? I am using the number 20D, which stands for the dual feed. So it is the open embroidery foot for visibility. I've selected my blanket stitch and have that all set up, but I also want to set up the hover mode. When I get to the hover mode screen, I am going to select needle down, how I want my foot to hover, and how high I want it to hover. So when you stop, your needle is down in the fabric and your foot comes up. That's correct. As I come to an area where I have to pivot, I stop and my foot automatically raises so that I can do the next stitch. And if I stop again, the foot will raise. So that's one less thing you have to think about when you're trying to maneuver all those shapes. That's correct. So whenever I stop, the foot automatically raises. And when you start, it goes down again. That's correct. And so for the areas where I don't need to raise the foot, I can speed up. And then as I come to a corner, when I stop, the foot raises. So I can actually do individual stitches one at a time. Not only that, but you have total control with both hands on your fabric. To experience all of the great features of the Bernina 8 Series machines, visit your local Bernina dealer today.